Congratulations on making a smart choice and purchasing the award-winning Dacia Duster. Rugged and robust, there's nothing between you and an adventure, apart from understanding how all the tech works. So let's get going. Right, safety first. Let's make sure those kids are sorted. In the rear of the car, on the two outer seats, you'll find the Isofix attachment points for child safety seats. If you need to apply the child safety lock, you can do it by sliding this switch on either rear door here. And to deactivate the passenger airbag, if putting a child seat in the front, you just need to turn this switch here on the driver's side. It'd be useful to start the engine, wouldn't it? So let's look at the start-stop tech. First up, the key card needs to be inside the car. Then, to press the clutch and press the start-stop button. No nonsense. To stop the car, just put the gear stick into neutral. Make sure the handbrake is on and again, just press the start-stop button. Inside the Dacia Duster, there's plenty of tech to get you excited. So let's start with the 7-inch touchscreen media nav system. First up, get your phone ready. To connect it via Bluetooth, make sure the Bluetooth option is turned on. Then select the phone menu, click on Search for Bluetooth device. Select the device from the drop-down menu and follow the instructions on your phone. Then you're good to go. You can then use smartphone voice recognition, so you can keep your hands and eyes safely on the road. For those banging tunes, just press radio and choose your favourite radio station, or press media to access the tunes in your phone. The volume adjuster is just behind the steering wheel, so you don't have to take your hands off. For navigation, make sure you're stationary with the handbrake on. Click on Nav, click on Agree, and then Destination. You just add the address in here, and you'll be on the right road. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are also compatible with the Dacia Duster. Just make sure to connect your phone using a manufacturer's cable for best results. If you're on a proper road trip, you might quite like the cruise control or speed limiter options on the Dacia Duster. The buttons can be found behind the gear stick and the speed can be adjusted using the plus and minus buttons on the steering wheel. The vehicle also has a handy hill start assist enabled. This will support you for approximately two seconds whilst you lift your foot from the brake to the accelerator, helping prevent rollback. Bonus! To reset the tyre pressure, for example after changing a tyre, you just need to click through the options on the steering wheel buttons until you see tyre pressure on the dashboard. Then press and hold for a few seconds to reset it. If any warning lights appear on your dashboard, refer to your handbook and call your local dealership. Epic road trippers need to be comfortable. To sort your seat out, just adjust here. And to make sure the steering wheel is at the right height for you, you push this lever down, move to your desired position, and then move the lever back up. Job done. If you're planning a family getaway or maybe a little shopping trip, the back seat split to allow for either. You can fold them down by pulling the levers on either side of the rear seats. To access the fuel cap on the Dacia Duster, just pull the fuel lever in the driver footwell and the cap will pop open. The boot opens with a simple press of a button here. And inside, just lift the floor plate up and you'll find the spare tyre. When you want to check the all-important oil and water, just pull the lever in the passenger footwell and then push the lever just under the bonnet. So that's the handover in the can. Now it's time to have some fun. Don't forget to book your first service in 12 months' time. And if you'd like more detailed information on anything you've seen in this video, just visit dacha.co.uk. Go enjoy!